Hello, boys and girls, and Merry Christmas. We're so excited that you are here with us today, and we have a story to share with you. Oh my gosh, it's such a good story. There's angels and donkeys. Wait, and... wait, wait, don't let, let's not get ahead of ourselves, Emily. We want to have room for the surprise. I'm just so excited. It's one of my favorite stories. You guys are in for a real treat. Once upon a time, in a land far, far away called Nazareth, there was a young woman named Mary. <laughs> Mary was like any other girl. She was not a queen or princess or a pop star like Jojo. She was just Mary, a girl from Nazareth. But there was something special about her. She had a good heart, filled with love for God. One day, an angel approached Mary. <gasps> Who are you? I am an angel of the Lord. My name is Gabriel, and I bring you good news. You do not need to be afraid, Mary. God would like for you to have a baby. This baby will be God's child, and he will be named Jesus. He will one day show the world the power of God's love, and he will save us all. Wow. That's amazing. I am honored that God has asked me to do the most important thing and be the mother of God's special child. Wonderful. Mary, you will be blessed. Soon God's spirit will come to you and give you this baby to grow inside of you. Maybe you would like to visit your cousin Elizabeth. She is going to have a baby also. And that baby is also very special from God in a different way. So Mary went to visit her cousin. <laughs> Meanwhile, Joseph, who loved Mary very much, was also visited by the angel. Joseph, Mary is carrying a child, and you will be a father to this child. Please love them both and care for them in the days ahead. Soon a declaration went out from Jerusalem. All the people needed to go home to their birthplaces so they could be counted by the government. Joseph got a donkey and placed Mary on it so they could make the journey to his home in Bethlehem. They crossed hills mountains and desert to get to Bethlehem. The journey was long. Finally, they arrived in Bethlehem and needed to look for a place to stay. Joseph, I'm so tired. Can you get us a room in the inn tonight? Hello? Do you have a room? No! Hello? Do you have a room? No! Beat it! They knocked on every door in town, it seemed, until... Do you have a room? Hmm, I am out of rooms, but I do have a stable where I keep my animals. You can sleep with them tonight. So Mary and Joseph went to the stable, and that night it happened. The baby Jesus was born. Angels were singing. And shepherds in the fields around Bethlehem came to the stable. Soon also visitors from far away lands came to greet the child Jesus. They brought him love, gifts, and adoration. He was a special child indeed. This is the child that we wait for, God's son. Jesus was born of Mary in a stable in Bethlehem, far, far away, and really long ago. God loved God's people, all of us, so much that he gave us his only son that we might know how big and large God's love really is. We hope you all really enjoyed this story. This is one of our favorite stories that we get to tell every year. And you all have a very, very Merry Christmas. Goodbye. Goodbye.